What's up, my friends? Raul Lopez Jr. here. I was uh, reading a post by uh, Ed Milet today, and it says, um, weird and unrealistic people lead the world. <laughs> and, uh, and, and that's the truth. People, there's, there's a couple of things I've experienced, but, but weird and unrealistic people are people like Einstein, the people like Elon Musk, they're e like original Tesla. Um, they're people who think beyond what the average person thinks and sees beyond, I think spiritually, into the universe of what is what we are capable of as human beings. We get we get messages, right? I, I sometimes say that when we're praying, um, we're we're talking to God, the universe, creator of the universe. But when we're meditating in a deep meditation, we're listening. We're, we're listening to God from above. And uh, both Tesla, original Tesla, and um, Nick Nicholas Tesla and uh, Albert Einstein, both said that the the world changing technologies that came to them came to them in a deep meditation so um weird and unrealistic people seem that way only because they are they are beyond what the average person thinks wants to think or feels they are capable of thinking <laughs> on a smaller level people who change the world people who are successful eliminate fear and take action Right, A lot of young men and women have success because they don't know enough to fear what they're trying to achieve. So they just go for it without fear and they have success. Sometimes it doesn't go that way, but a lot of times it does. Challenge being, as we get older and we we, we start to learn about what happened, what's good and what's bad, or we start to have a few... Um, what am I looking for? Uh, not, I don't want to say negatives, but we have a few... I'll, I'll give you an example. When I was very young, I got into real estate investing and I just kept having good deal after good deal after good deal. Every once in a while, I'd have a bad deal, right? It wouldn't, wouldn't go the way I wanted it to. I'd, I'd be a money loser. It'd be a loser. So the fact that there were more good deals than bad, it wasn't really an issue. But as I got older, I started to analyze and say, I don't want to have a bad deal anymore. So is that a bad deal? I'd overanalyze and then I wouldn't do as many deals, right? So the people who know just enough to be dangerous are the successful ones. The people who eliminate the fear and just go for it and never stop are the successful ones. The weird and unrealistic people are the world changers. Who are you? Who do you want to be? What are you doing? What's stopping you? Don't let it. Get out there. Get things done. Change the world. Change your life. Change your family's life. And change the world. Enjoy the day.